Well, I'm having to divide video 46 into two <laughs> because it's too big to upload in to YouTube in one piece. Well, I'm fishing this peg at, at Fordington tonight. It's, uh, it's now half past six. I've just put in. It's uh, a lovely still evening. It can be quite a blustery and breezy sort of spot, <laughs> Fordington. And last time I was here, I seem to remember having a nice little chub. And after that, I, yeah, I think I blanked. Yeah, I had a couple of pulls, but that was it. So we'll settle down now and uh, just see what the evening brings. The river is going down, having had a couple of feet in it yesterday. So with the river falling, it's uh, it's not particularly good. And a falling river, Barmelant. Uh, they're probably full from all the stuff they've been eating during the flood. <laughs> and uh, they're a bit reluctant when the river's going down. But, you know, it's a nice evening. Sit here and read the book and see what, uh, see what it brings. Hopefully we'll get a barbell on the bank, but you never know. He's prime. <laughs> yeah, bless you, still off. Still not allowed back on. <laughs> I think he gets it. Oh, yes. <laughs> That's pretty cagey, Tom. <laughs> Barbalo chub. You want to net it for you? Yeah. It wasn't the vicious of takes, was it?
water. <laughs> well done, that man. Absolutely superb, spot on. Just what you want to see. Nice mouth. Doesn't have any hooks in it. Beautiful. I don't know what it wears. I won't wait. I don't think it's a double, so it's not really worth weighing. But it's a lovely fish. And uh, I'll put him straight back in. Well, <clears throat> when fishing at distance, as I am here, quite a long way downstream, um, the angle of the line to the fish's mouth though, is, is quite small. So that when you strike, when a fish picks the bait up and you strike, the tendency is to pull the hook and the bait out of the fish's mouth. And if it's a small hook, um, Either it won't set, or if it catches, it doesn't catch strongly enough. And in the struggle, the fish tends to come off, which is what happened with that first fish. So, when that fish had come off, I changed the hook to a larger size hook. And it seemed to prove uh, the right thing to have done. Because that second fish was well hooked, and uh, had no difficulty landing it. One of the nice things about Fordington, with it being so flat, you can see for miles. And you get these huge skies and magnificent sunsets. Just listen to the silence. Sheep and birds, that's all you hear. And on a calm day like today, it's a lovely place to fish. And now the sun has just gone down behind those distant clouds. Wonderful. Hopefully, it brings the barbell out to play. <laughs>